Guys, just going to bring you another quick video um, of how to fix the black screen when you load your JTAG um, Xbox 360. Um, I've just been loading mine and it won't load, it just goes to a black screen. So I'm going to wait for my Xbox to load up and uh, show you what you can do to um, fix the black screen so yeah so if you see I've got my uh, menus loading but then that's as far as it goes so it comes up it's fully stealthed I'm using live emulation stealth server uh, I've been online now for three weeks perfect but as you can see there's the black screen so what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch over to the PC and uh, show you what I would do. Um, but before I do that, what you want to do, you want to turn off your Xbox and then load it up again, press power it on and after you've powered it on, open the DVD drive before it starts to load. So I'll see you back on the PC. Right guys, so uh, what we do is um, we will load up the hard drive as you can see. Um, I've got my JTAG, got Neighbourhood installed. Um, <coughs> got my JTAG there double click on that there's my hard drive retail hard drive you want then what I would do is I will copy my launch.ini drag that over a fresh fresh INI yes to all and then that will copy over a fresh launch.ini that will take off all the plugins which you might have installed. Uh, let me just check, actually. Um, okay. Load that up. Now, if you go down, I've got all the plugins there. So, what you want to do is you want to delete these plugins. You want to delete all the plugins apart from live emulation which is a stealth server and the xbdm that's all you want to do you want to file save then you want to close that down then copy that back over yes to all then that will be copied over what we might do while we are here as well uh, no, there's no point. So, if I close that down <coughs> and then turn off my Xbox, I will see you back on the Xbox. So now we're back on the Xbox just gonna load it up and uh, see if it's worked it should have <coughs> um, uh, so it takes a little while to load up my Xbox I don't know why it's just got a lot of um, a lot of stuff on the hard drive and it's, I've got a um, live animation which uh, I put on there as well, so it's probably probably adjusted the time a bit. Uh, my next video, <coughs> my next video, I'll be showing you how to uh, flash the NAND, fix a corrupted NAND on your Xbox. Um, yeah, so here we go. Fingers crossed.
Okay, so there you go. So we're up and running. Everything's working again. So that's how you get come up, get over the uh, black screen. So just swap out your launch.ini, take off your plugins. Um, you might have to turn it, power it on and off, try and boot it up a couple of times um, after, after you've uh, done the changes, but then it should load. So I hope you find this useful. Um, if you want to see more videos, uh, please feel free to subscribe and like. And um, yeah, see you. See you next time. Cheers. Bye.